Andre Becker, Berkeley Patton to take the opening face off for game two here at the CN Center. Off we go. Cougars will win the game's first face off as Jumanzi slides it ahead to Zach Funk. Funk now still inside the Cougar zone. Kamat turns it over to Catton. Go to the top one. Timer shovel day off. Great save, Ravensburger with the left pad. And now Funk gets by McIsaac. Tangles up there with Feist below the goal line. Ballas still has it. Ballas wrapper a chance to get the shot away. To Henry Quill. He scores! Another rocket from Pete Dohaniak. And the Cougars strike first in game two. Two Hollisters in two games for Dohaniak. And the Cougars score first. Ballas does the work behind the net to get him with the puck. A great job going behind the net. We're going to go to Thornton. Thornton to Riley Height, goes to Funk with timer, goes over top of the goal. Cowan may have got a piece, but Zach Funk from that area scores a lot of goals with Cowan up to the town. Three here is Owen Martin. He goes to Mays. His shot tip stop by Ravensburger. Rebound is leapfrog on by the Cougar goaltender. But was sitting there. Ravensburger sitting down, but was able to get his glove on him. He'll hold on. By Cohen Zemer. Good job by Zemer trying to get in behind Kraven. And Zemer, a big tap below the goal line. Hits a roar from the crowd. And the Cougars are trying to take it away here at center. They will. Crampton shot goes wide, the goal. Puck is loose to the side. Here's a chance in front. Great save, Ravensburger. It's loose on his right pad, and he holds on. Owen Martin down on the ice, shovel day off, and Paul's getting into it after the whistle. Another great job by Ravensburger to keep calm and hold on. Way by Venom. His pass turned over. Parasat goes to Zach Funk. Zach Funk trying to get it by. He does. Great move. Shoots. Oh, what a save by Cowell at the right pad. Oh, a terrific move from Funk. Now Funk gets it back again. Funk centers it to Becker, but he couldn't corral it. Hold Chevel Dayoff taken away by Strom. It's a 2 on 0. Strom with Denis. Denis on the left wing. Strom to Denis. Scores! Nothing. Taking advantage of a turnover in its own end. It is a 2 on 0. How rare is that? Right wing to Zemer. Zemer into the Spokane zone. Here, Zemer holds to the goal. It's the it's strike in the ball paint. Where is it? Puck's still loose. It is still loose. And now the whistle sounds. Draw in on the four check. Collides with Crampton. McLennan's in there also. He's flattened below the goal line. It's actually going to be a penalty to Spokane. It's going to come to Paponicus. Funk is loose. Still in behind. Funk gets it free. Funk up top to Becker. Becker, midpoint Thornton. Hudson Thornton. Andre Becker one time on the crossbar. McIsaac, here comes Spokane with a great play, but here's Bonnie gets it back, spins it to McIsaac, stopped by Ravensburg, and oh, what a save by the corner goaltender, and a great chance for McIsaac all alone. Dawson Cowan out to play, it's a cramp, and taken away by McLennan, down low to Chandler Joie, hit for Foster scores! The Cougars fourth line comes through and delivers, Aiden Foster makes a four up in Chris George. That is a one-time from Boston at 14.24 of this second period. And number 20, Nick. Here comes Cohen Zemer. He shoots the rebound. He scores. Cohen the save. On his on the rebound. Cougars lead 5 nothing in the second. This comes just one minute after the Foster goal. Now casting on the rebound. When it rains, it pours. And here they come again. There's another old man rush. Cohen Zeber, two commits. Scores! Are you watching this? Cougars lead 6 nothing. Billy M. Commits and on. I'm watching. I'm not sure I believe it. Two goals in 13 seconds. Zeber is just on goal. Three goals in one thirteen. This is just out of the ordinary. Seven of this game, Prince George up six nothing. Face up one by Spokane, a shot toward the goal. It's tipped in, and in, they score! It was tipped by Martin and went by the blocker of Ravensburg. 
And the Chiefs get on the board at 6-1. to one. So a deflection 58 seconds into the uh, third period, and that ends the Prince George scoring streak. Van Olm, Van Olm goes up top to Martin. He shoots, scores! Owen oh, Martin, a shot from the left circle, might have hit the leg of Paponicus, and the Chiefs have cut the lead to four. And for the uh, Spokane Chiefs, that is a power play goal. And you were right, Paconicus will get credit for that goal. Martin let the shot go, but there was a deflection in front that handcuffed Ravensburger and went in. Braden Crampton ahead, left wing to Leighton Feist. Feist will walk his way and he shoots and scores! Leighton Feist sneaks it to the legs of Ravensburger and the lead's cut in half with 542 remaining. Well, that's one that Ravensburger wants back, no question about that as Feist lets the shot go, coming down the wing, gets into that left circle, and somehow puts it through Ravensburgen's legs. Captain with the midpoint, Feist holds his shot, tip scores! Two goal game with 1.10 to go, Leighton Feist, his second of the game, it's 6-4. Blasting it from just inside to the blue line, Feist tallies with 70 seconds left in the third period to bring Spokane within two. O'Reilly Height has the empty net. He'll walk his way in. Goes to Parasek. He'll shoot and score. <laughs> empty net goal, Tarek Parasek. Makes it 7-4. That should do it here at CN Center. That's game set and match. And Parasek becomes the 15th. Prince George Cougar to get a point in this game. Cougars take a two games to on series lead. 7-4 winners over the Spokane Chiefs.